the crap they know 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 the crap
a beige, beigey looking color. It's giving me more, more of a goldish hue. I guess because of the white Casadoni throws off a goldish hue to it. Okay, so I think I'm gonna add a little more of the white Chalcedony. This is it's a little bit too goldish. So I'm gonna add a little bit more of that. Let's see. Make this happen. I wanted a, a beige looking color. Maybe I should have used the white pearl and the uh, brown. Let's, let's see what that does. I mean, I got a whole eight ounce over there that I'm waiting for. Uh, this is, it's not really bad. Uh, okay, this, this is what I'm gonna do. All right, since I've already have that and I don't like wasting anything. I am going to add a little bit of the white pearl. Well, I won't, I got to refill that bottle. Just one second. Where's my white pearl? Oh, there it is. My white pearl. All right. Stick so we won't be double dipping. See what I'm putting in? remember we got a whole eight ounce cup of resin so this is probably what I should have done at the, at the first time you know but I didn't so oh that gold and the silver is trying to blend together oh my <laughs> well I do have my uh, I, I have the look I have the look <laughs> all right I have the look Oh, isn't that beautiful? I've got to hurry up because uh, this is really warm. The look. I love that. That is cute. Cute color. And I'm pouring it all into my 8 ounce cup. Alright. Pouring it into my 8 ounce cup. I'm not gonna mix that. Looks even funnier um, after we add it, add it to it. But it's great. I think it'll mingle well. Looks really different, a little bit. I don't know. So, okay, let me go ahead, close my jars, because this is gonna happen really fast. All right, close my jars, get everything out of the way. And this time, instead of my heat gun, I'm gonna use my blow dryer. All right, so we already starting something different. <laughs> use my blow dryer. All right, well, the blow dryer that I have for work out here in the shop. Whew. Okay, I got a little bit of stuff up here. Hopefully it'll disappear. All right. And this look like it's good enough. Okay. So this is what we're doing. We're gonna top this off. Go ahead and get it topped off with uh, this gold looking color. Oh, by the way, my uh, board was, or is dry from the Mod Podge. Look like you're spreading a cake. Okay, you're spreading a nice cake. All right. If it falls off on the edge, it's fine. We can easily pick it up off the mat. Okay. Um, I'm thinking, I'm trying to think, should I use my uh, heat gun first? Let's see. 
because I'm not using a torch, okay? See, most people use torches when they do this type thing. Well, actually, I don't, I don't recall seeing someone do this. <laughs> uh, so maybe uh, we'll just play it by ear. How's that? I'm gonna put some more over there. We're gonna really put it here in the middle so it can spread out. I'll use that for something else. Um, I wanna see something for a second. All right. Popping some bubbles and pushing it away. I'm gonna get my dryer. Just gonna let that be for a moment. Let's make sure we have this one plugged up. Nope, it's not plugged up. This is, oh, my hands is getting it so dirty. <laughs> Look, I'm already getting into getting stuff everywhere. Let's plug this up. moment. One moment, please. All right. Since I haven't used this in a while, let's go ahead and get all of the rough stuff out. Just in case. Okay. So now we are more prepared to put our art to work here, okay? So we're gonna do, we're gonna go here and pour, all right? Gonna add this brown. Okay. the red right we'll go with the fake orange <laughs> the fake orange right and we're going with the yellow right We're going to come back with the green right here. We're going to also come back with the brown over here. Okay. Whew. Wish me luck, guys. What I want to do now, I've got my heat gun. I'm going to go through and make sure because I want some of my effects to come up. I want it to show some effects. All right. Okay. That is beautiful. All right. Now, y'all 
probably saying, Felicia, you don't like the waste resin. No, I don't. And I have a lot on my table. But what I'm going to do is after it cures, I'll pick it up and cut it up and make it into um, another piece of art. Okay. So let's just. Let's one moment. All right. I, I somehow feel like I need a little bit of gold in that in, in all of this so I'm gonna take ah uh, I'll take this and add a little bit of glitter gold all right because these colors are very very nice I love them Love them, love them, love them. They're cute. I like what it's doing. I like where it, where it's going. I like everything about it. I just feel like I want some gold attached to it. Okay. I need to put a little bit in here. It's kind of on the thick side now. Okay. So. I don't know if it's gonna do right or not. Oh, what if I mess it up? <laughs> oh my my my. Let's let's don't. I like I like this. I I like all of this. I'm I'm not gonna do it. Change of plans. <laughs> I'm not gonna do it. Change of plans. Okay. So. Um, let me take you down for a closer look and then what I'm going to do is uh, get you off of here and we'll be back when it is time to see the final look. Did you see that? Honey, that is all May Spring, okay? That is all of May Spring. Look at the beauty right there. Can you see it? That's so nice. That's pretty, 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 pretty. It's pretty, pretty, pretty. I like it, like it, like it, like it, I like it a lot. Look at here. Oh, my, my, my. That's going to be gorgeous. All right, so we'll be back. Okay, I am back. Um, Crafty Creators, this is not totally dry, okay? But I can touch it, all right? I can touch it and I won't leave, you know, any kind of imprint on it. All right, so what I, I got here is 80 milliliters. And I'm gonna put this 80 milliliters up on top of it. And then I'm gonna add a little bit of gold, all right? So, all right, let's pour this on. Um, go along in here. Go along in here. And what I actually I'm gonna try to just put it all over and uh see can I get it to spread some? Alright. Get it to spread and I will be able to take my heat gun and even it out. Alright. Um, this is something that I like to do sometimes is take my uh, fingers and rub it in. Um, I guess it's just because I, I like the feel of it. When I feel it, it makes me feel like um, everything is going on as planned. Like I'm really putting my all into it. So yeah, like I said, it was, it's, it's not uh, completely dry, but it is dry enough so that I can spread this around a little bit without making a mess, All right? Okay, now let's get it started, right? Let's heat that up a little bit. 
make sure we don't have any um, bubbles. throw a little bit of this gold on um, okay and I'm gonna come off through here just like that Ooh, I almost dug it in there. Oh no, friend, don't dig. Just do it slightly. All right. Slightly, my friend, slightly. Okay, so that should be enough of gold up there. Now, try to push this one way or the other. Um, Y'all saw me do this before. nice looking I like it uh, I think I want to go somewhere up in here just a little bit and I'm actually pressing down a little bit too hard but hopefully um, everything a dry level And I think that's all I want to do. Um, I don't want to overdo it with the gold. And I didn't want to underdo it. But I wanted it done enough so that it would look nice. Um, let's see. Right here. try to you know, see right right there I pressed it a little bit too hard and I'm hoping that it'll be okay. All right. Like I said, uh, I think this is all I want to do to it. I don't want to do any more because it don't need it. But I do have... This, uh, I have a little bit of gold that's in this thing here that I'm going to use. I'm going to try to see, can I, uh, give me one second, please. little bit of clear it's not very much but oh well I thought I was gonna work it but it didn't but I'll pick up 
the remaining that's falling down. And I will put it in here. So if you ever have extra that's left over, just, you know, try to put it somewhere so you don't waste too much. Like, that's a lot of resin that's there. But I, I got other plans for using it, so maybe it won't be as bad. And I'm trying to take this uh, clear and just run, run my hands over it. I had already stuck my hands into it, so. Maybe it'll be okay. And this, this is all I'm doing on this right here. Just kind of blending it so it can be one solid color on the back. Okay. This is not uh, necessary. I, I just didn't want to waste any, any resin. Okay. All right. For now, friends. Okay, my crafty creators, I wanted to bring you back really quick because I've already done the top coat and now I'm putting on um, these little pieces here. I got these for the numbers because I didn't go get any numbers. Okay, um, so they're not stuck up there yet. I've got four more to do. So I said, let me bring you all to see how I'm doing this. So I have the checkers mold and i'm using just the regular round ones not the one with the crown and i'm using some bright gold crushed glass bits all right so i put a little bit of uv resin in and then i go back and i sprinkle some glass bits on top just like that okay sprinkle it on top little sprinkle 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 so I wanted this to be totally um, <clears throat> custom I didn't want anything to be um, so that you know already kind of built I wanted to be custom totally custom so that's where we're at right now and so I stirred these around a little bit in there um, things going nice just like that all right and the uv resin i'm using is the paduo uv resin hard okay that's what i'm using this one seems as if it needs a little more but i'm gonna go with it okay so now what we're going to do is get the UV lamp. I have a UV lamp that I use to cure these. Sometimes I use a flashlight and sometimes I use a lamp. And right now I'm using the lamp because, you know, I want to get it done faster, a little bit faster. So I put my lamp on it. Um, I'm going to do 60 seconds. One full minute, and then we'll be ready to get these on, get the rest of them on and situate it, and we'll be able to put those down um, like so, and everything will be great. I think I need to do a, a cure for the top part, because the top part is seems like it's not completely done, but I like that, okay? I like it. I like it a lot. 
And at first I was gonna use just regular half balls. Um, with, I was gonna do just regular gold, but I, well, here it is like this, but I didn't really like it like that. So um, then there was this piece right here that it was left into my little um, pour. And I was like, hmm, I said, that's round about the size that I need. And I thought a little bit more and I said, okay, you know what? This is the idea that I want, but I'm gonna use the um, the pieces for the checkers, okay? Those look like they're about ready, but that's what I do. I'm gonna cure for another 30 seconds. When I bring you back, um, I'll be showing you the next step, okay? Okay, now we have everything, the numbers are on. I just, I think this one would be more elegant for this piece here. I I, I just like it. Uh, this is the whole clock mechanism, all right? So when I um, come back, we'll be, we will be putting that on, all right? So it can be hanging on the wall because my, um, my subscriber said, well, let it be a clock. It will be beautiful as a clock. So that's what we're doing. We're making it out of a clock. Viewer's choice, okay? So let me show you really quick um, how I'm gonna start this. I'll get my UV resin, all right? I'm gonna put a little dot on the back. I'm gonna sit it down. All right. Sit it down. And I'm gonna just tap it a little bit. And I'll take my clock, I mean my lamp, and put it up there for about 30 seconds. And from that way, I'll just be going on and on and on and on doing it like that, okay? So let me get this, this cured. I'll let this 30 seconds die down. I won't hold you for this part. So that one is in place it's nice and secured and i can go on to the next and on and on and on so right now i'm going to it looks like i can do maybe three at a time so that's what i'm gonna do three at a time right Remember to tap a little bit. Go ahead to your next one. Okay, I'm gonna put this down. Okay. Oh, it's got a little bit running out. When you find when you find it like this, um, I'll show you what I'm gonna do. Where's my little paper towel? So when it runs out like that, just clean it up before it gets started, okay? Just clean it off. That was a little too much up there. And I'm gonna put this back there. I did it again. I moved it. Oh. Moved it. I moved it. Give me one second. So I'm gonna take it and just try to clean around the edge. I don't think that's gonna do any good. All right, one more time. <laughs> so you all can see that accidents does happen. 
all right it does happen all right so now i'm not gonna mess with it leave it right there so that was my oh well, that one one two and three okay and what i might do i might still put another coat of resin on top of this i'm just so not sure yet All right so i'm looking actually this is gonna go here i can't have to see my marks like there is a, a place on the internet that you can actually have the clock um, and print it out where you're supposed to put your pieces at and does this one have anything under it no not yet okay chill out <laughs> chill out all right 30 seconds is what I'm going for and I will be back okay everybody this concludes this video what do you think about it i like it i like it a lot okay so um i'll see you on the next one bye for now